photo of a Target cashier is going viral because right now what we can learn from all of it is a real story. CBS 4's Carson Quinn shows us this lesson in kindness. It's a photo that's been now shared thousands of times, but it all started with a cashier at Target who showed an act of kindness. Had I known it was going to go viral, I would have tried to do him more justice. You're welcome. Thank you. Today was the first time Sarah Bigler and Ishmael Gilbert, a cashier at Target, have seen each other since this photo went viral earlier this week. Sarah says it was just an ordinary Tuesday. Frazzled after work with two kids in tow, she pops into the Glendale Target. Hoping she's in and out, she gets in a shorter line. But the elderly woman ahead of her is paying in change. I was at first irritated and frustrated and thinking of my long day and I had this unnecessary timeline to get home and get the kids bathed and you know and I stopped for a moment. She noticed that Ishmael was helping this woman coin by coin. You know quarters, nickels, dimes, pennies and she's apologized kept telling me you know she's sorry and I'm telling her you're fine. Someone else was also watching Sarah's three and a half year old daughter. And I thought this stranger is teaching my daughter something that I could never teach her. The photo was snapped and posted, and then it went viral. It came from having at least 200 shares to I seen 500 shares. Next thing you know, 1,000. It's just been amazing. Would you like this in the back? But while the fame is exciting, Ishmael says his treatment of that woman is what he gives to all customers. And there you go, man. I treat everybody with the same respect, and I get it back in return. Target reps say that they usually show appreciation and recognition for those employees that have gone above and beyond, and Ishmael will probably receive a gift later this week. On the North Side, Carson Quinn, CBS 4 News. Well, that is wonderful. Oh, that's terrific. Okay, great. Oh, watching the timing on this forecast.